Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So, just as Jasper was finishing up, Kira <laughs> was around, as was Hair Bear, and uh, William was about. Now, Kira was about because Hair Bear is around. And as you've seen in earlier videos, Kira doesn't like Hair Bear at the moment. You know, as lovely as Kira is, and she loves being picked up and she loves being cuddled and she flops around all over the place. She is cunning. Kira. And when she's got a bee in her bonnet about another cat as she has now, she's relentless. And she also knows that Hair Bear, unlike Woody, won't stand and fight. She will back off. She's nervous. And Kira keeps pushing. I don't know what started it. But Hair Bear has been around where Kira is now. And Kira will track her. around the rocks, in fact she'll track her up, the, she'll pursue her up the tree. <laughs> Kira's ruthless.
it's great to watch this for anyone that thinks that blind cats can't live as regular cats. You know, everything is there. They can pursue, they can track, they can sniff. Their senses are there, their smell, their instincts are all there. They are just like regular cats. In fact, I think they're better than regular cats. The way they use their senses and their instincts to overcome that disability. But they don't know they've got a disability. But the way they use it, the way that we can all see That's Momo. Momo is blind. Tabs was hanging around because I forgot he hadn't had his breakfast. Harry had walked off by now. He was sitting on the wall. I don't know what he was doing, let's just listening. Instead of Kira coming down the tree, now she will go up. Don't know why she did that. But this next video will follow on. There'll be a follow on to this when she comes down from the top of the tree. Interesting. Hope you've enjoyed the video thus far, everyone. And we will see you again very soon.